Hello from Epcot, everybody. It is a bright and early morning today because we have breakfast reservations at the Garden Grill. So the Garden Grill is part of Character Dining. You can meet Chip and Dale and some of the other friends. It's right in the Land Pavilion where Soaring is and where Living with the Land Ride is. The walls are still up for the Moana area. It's gonna be right back here. We've got some new signage right here in front of us. Peeking up from the walls, you can kind of see what's going on back there, but not really. So when you first come into Epcot and you are in front of Spaceship Earth, you're gonna to head to the right. You'll be passing the Moana area right there that's still under construction. You're gonna come right in front of the seas with Nemo and friends. And then you're gonna to head to the Land Pavilion, which is in that direction. And I am talking, of course, specifically about the Chippendale Harvest Breakfast over at the Land Pavilion, nowhere else. And by the way, the restaurant's name is Garden Grill. I think I keep forgetting to mention that. So we are just headed right to breakfast because it was just 10 o'clock when we came in and our reservation is for 10.20. So typically you need to check in about 15 to 20 minutes before your reservation. And if you have the My Disney app or My Disney Experience app, you can actually check in on the app. So we've already checked in and they'll send you a text when your table's ready. Looks like Pluto's out. And this is the seating here. This actually rotates ever so slowly. And there are some scenes that you can see I'm not sure if it's rotating today though. It doesn't look like it's moving. And I am not alone. I am with my honey, Marky Mouse. <laughs> hey guys, how's it going? Guys, we've been watching. Unfortunately, it's not rotating today. Um, that's a shame. Maybe they're working on it. Maybe they're fixing it. I don't know. But I can tell you, we've eaten here several times. We normally have eaten here at dinner. And the menu changes a little bit seasonally. There is one particular time of the year where it's kind of like a Thanksgiving menu. Um, I love breakfast. Breakfast is my favorite food of the day. And this restaurant has been closed for a bit um, as far as breakfast goes. They were open for dinner, but not for breakfast. They opened the breakfast option maybe about a month, month and a half ago. And as soon as I saw that, I jumped on the reservations. Remember, if you are visiting Disney World, you've got up to 60 days ahead of your visit to go ahead and make your reservations at any of the restaurants. So keep that in mind. And I was supposed to be testing the new mics today on you guys. And of course, what do I do? I forget the little clip where the mic goes on. So maybe on my next vlog, you guys get to hear the new mics. I know my voice is not back 100%, so I'm hope you're hearing me loud and clear. And we were just seated, and look, we already have some watermelon and some delicious cinnamon bread. That smells amazing. Wow, this looks great. Look oh my that. God, look at that. Oh yeah, that looks good. <laughs> So we got confirmation it is not rotating but you're allowed to walk around and see what's here to see we're actually on the second level there's two levels one that faces like all of the scenery and one up above we're on the top level so we're going to get to see mickey pluto and chip and dale very exciting <laughs> and this is going to be all you care to eat so they're going to bring out the skillet and then they'll refill whatever it is you want refilled <laughs> One thing you have to try when you have breakfast on Disney property is pod juice. It's passion fruit, orange juice, and guava. I always thought there was mango in it. This stuff is delicious, guys. It's one of those things that Disney does well, so you must try it. There goes Pluto, there goes Mickey. <laughs> and the food has arrived. We didn't realize that we get steak with this. So this is steak with ranchero sauce. We've got some bacon, eggs, potatoes, and of course, you can't forget the Mickey waffles. 
but wow as i mentioned this is all you care to eat so they will refill whatever you need <laughs> Wow, you're up early. <laughs> Are you hungry or did you have food? Is that you? <laughs> <laughs> he would eat it all. <laughs> okay, I'm not a big steak and egg person, but this steak is delicious. It's got the ranchero sauce, which is not spicy. Um, it's a little smoky but very very flavorful it's very savory the way the flavors are popping it's really good very good the waitress says it's good too he's so trying to steak both like it a lot what do you think babe mm, that's pretty good yeah The sauce is unbelievable. <laughs> what makes it like so awesome? Is that Mickey? Oh my god, Mickey! Good morning! How are you? Great to see you! Oh boy! <laughs> Did I sound like you? A little bit, a little bit. <laughs> <It's>... <laughs> you want me to stand up? <laughs> oh, oh yeah, I got you on my shirt. There you are. And on my hat. <laughs> It's so nice to see you, Mickey. So good to see you, Mickey. You, Mickey. Were you the one cooking this meal for us? Yeah? Yeah? Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Have a great day, Mickey. Thank you. It's so nice to see you. Can I take a selfie with you? How have you been today? Very good. Are you are you hungry? I'll tell you the food is really good. I don't know if you cooked it and Mickey Mouse said it was him. I don't know. <laughs> it wasn't him, it was you. Okay, well. That Mickey. You gotta get some chicken there waffles. Yes. Yes, I agree. I'll vote. If you say vote, I'll, I'll be voting for that. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> so the eggs, I'm very particular about the eggs. They're not runny, they're not dry, they're Thank super, you. super oh, moist oh, and fluffy. They are just right in my book. <laughs> so we asked about the potatoes because they're very very creamy and I can tell that they had some kind of cheese in it but I couldn't put my finger on it and they're, they're very flavorful as well like they don't need any salt or anything so they have white cheddar and something called black diamond cheddar I've never heard of that and I'm thinking that that might be the flavor that I'm not quite figuring out. That's really good. <laughs> oh my god. Hello. Yep. So I'm curious, have you guys heard of black diamond cheddar? Does it actually have diamonds in it? Comment below. So look what they gave us as a parting gift. We get this beautiful card signed by all four characters that we saw today. We have found that a lot of times when we go dining to a character breakfast place, they do give us a little postcard. I love these postcards. I've been collecting them. I have them in a little spot. My plan is to actually eventually frame them all. I want you guys to keep in mind that character dining can cost a little more because you're paying for the experience and you're paying to meet the characters. Um, so it's gonna get a little expensive for you guys that are coming for the first time. Just prepare. Those character meals are gonna cost a little more. So they're already getting ready for lunch, they're already cleaning up. I'm going to take you guys on a little walk around the outside. Um, it is undergoing maintenance just for today, so it wasn't rotating. But I'm going to show you guys what you would typically see when it's rotating. So right below us is the land ride. And you'll have some scenery from the land. This is part of that. This is when you're in the desert. So all of this rotates and you get to see part of the land ride as it's rotating. I find the land ride to be very relaxing, very cool. It's very informative. And look, we got some buffalo. And my favorite part of the land ride is when you get up to this beautiful little farmhouse right here and you've got the chickens, you've got the dog barking.
I love all of that detail. <laughs> so cool. If you want some really good quick service, you also have Seasons, which is right here in the Land Pavilion as well. So the Land has a 15 minute wait right now, which is not too bad. There is my honey. And Soarin' typically has a long line. That is a great ride. So you do have the Lightning Lane options for Soarin' and right now it's only a 25 minute wait. So if you're here and there's a 25 minute wait for Soarin', get on that ride. It is really, really good. It's got all of this immersive scents and beautiful, beautiful views. So 25 minutes, that is not bad at all. If you're coming to Epcot and you want a really nice, wholesome, yummy breakfast, brunch, we're gonna call it brunch today because we started at about 10.45 to eat. But you've got the characters, Chip and Dale, Mickey and Pluto. It is really special, guys. It's in a great pavilion, so pretty, especially when it's going around, when it's rotating. And it's gonna be rotating tomorrow. They're just doing repairs today or maintenance today. So we do recommend that. Just remember, you've got a budget. Any character dining is gonna cost you a little extra. But I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you guys have subscribed. Leave me a comment also below. Have you been here before? Or is this something that you're thinking of coming to visit? See you in the next one.